You were supposed to hoot. We shall speak later. We must return to the tourney now. It's, it's time for the second contest. Sirs, what seeks you in my lady's tent? Inspiration? Be gone from here! Before us, look upon chivalry's best and most storied. Come from far lands, here to seek glory. Hear now their names as I shout them aloud. Savor their titles of their presence, be proud. Palmerin, the Baron of Longfall. Lead us of Metida. Rainfarn of Atra. Home at a spark of make. Domimir of Troy. Guy de Boisfren, in service to the Duchess. Delwyn of Craigiao. Count Ty of Dondal. And say of Lyria and Rivia, a prince. Geralt of Rivia! For Gregoire of Mont Gorgon, let out a roaring cheer! The faint flower of silence, Tony Champion from last year! Today's winner of contests, his victory to secure, shall face a Gregoire in a challenge severe! Does ignorance demand a part in deceit? Does someone need telling how tourneys proceed? How dare you enter a tourney for nobly born knights? Your knighthood came through the grace of my mother, Meath, Queen of Lyria and Rifia, whom you treacherously deserted mere days later. Your presence here is an offense to my honor. And yours is an offense to my eyes. If you're done, step aside, Prince. Tony's protector, the mate Vivian. Her beauty enchances both beasts and men. My heart's greetings, dear knights. May my grace guide you and show you the path of honor, valor, and glory. Accept my wishes of good fortune, sir, and devote all your strength to the tourney, and only it. The time has come for you, Sir Knight. Mount your steed. Swift be your flight. Ladies and gentlemen of lineage illustrious, soon steeds shall swarm like ants most industrious. To beat time's passage, their rides like the game. What a sight to behold, what a lark, what a tale. Before us, Geralt, from Rithia come, fast as the wind, bright as the sun. Such a sound!
flesh of such style, such grace, such speed. To watch was a pleasure, a treat indeed. To honor our entrance, praise each fair night. We shall feast from eve till dawn's first light. The finest of wine and food shall be served. If you've blood in your veins, come collect what's deserved. I congratulate you. Here, your prize. A saddle adorned with your crest. Many thanks. By the way, my mate saw a man with white hair sneak out of my tent. Would you know who it might have been? No idea. How juvenile. Congratulations on your win. In stellar style, no less. Ah. I no longer regret I was not able to participate. Almost. We must drink to this. Come with me to the feast. We shall await Vivian together. Lead the way. So, any thoughts on Vivian? Her beauty is striking. That is not what I ask. Still too early to say anything I'd be willing to stand behind. Managed to figure one thing out. She uses powerful magic, masking illusions. Do you mean to say she might in truth look different than she seems? Only guessing right now. We've still some time before Vivian arrives. Let us drink. To Vivian, may you find the means to aid her. To Vivian. Ah, when I first laid eyes on her, I finally understood what all those poems and ballads were trying to say. Love's not poetry alone. Sometimes it's prose. Sometimes it's just plain ugly. You say that only because you do not know Vivian as I do. A life with her would be sweetness itself. Actually, you don't know her all that well either. Presence at this tourney is an affront to my honor. I demand satisfaction. Head to the nearest brothel then. Coward. Mounted combat in the main arena. I challenge you. Since you insist, I'm all yours. You shall bitterly regret deserting my mother's army once I'm done with you. May the blood I will spill wash away the stain of your cowardice! Let's get this over with. Quick. Three. Two. One! Move it! What now, you piece of filth? Reasons unknown except to them, the gods have chosen to punish me with defeat. But do not think your cowardice will be forgotten. Damn it, you still going on about that? Need to clear this up once and for all. Had to abandon your mother's camp back then because someone else needed my help. Badly. Couldn't refuse them. Didn't want to, in fact. <sighs> you mean to say, you had a secret mission? Set off to accomplish it, having vowed to tell no one of its nature, until you did? Something like that, minus the vow. And, uh, I'd still rather not divulge the nature of my secret mission. Can you accept that as justification? 
In agreeing to duel, you proved yourself a true knight. Thus, I accept your word as that of a man of honor. Glad to hear it. Now I got work to do. heart swells to behold this beautiful celebration of valor and honor, and to witness you, who embody the chivalric virtues in your lives, strive for greatness. Yet, after a time of combat must come a time of peace and respite. Thus, I invite all who fought in the tourney to this feast held in your, and none others, honor. And should any among you crave solitude, Private tents await you nearby. The group melee shall take place on the morrow. Glory shall be within grasp for each and every one of you. The best among you shall have the honor to face our reigning champion, the famed Grégoire de Gourgon, victor of last year's tourney. Celebrate, make merry, revel as you will, yet be mindful of the trial that awaits you tomorrow. Follow her. We shall meet in your tent before your last contest. You must help her. That grey domed scoundrel, ever seeking Lady Vivian, some kind of maniac. Strange. We're sure I'd find her here. Flew off. Worth going after. Looks like the bird's leading me somewhere.
cave. Witcher. Lady Vivian? Counted on me getting lost. I did. I thought you no different from the knights. Good at tourneys, hopeless in the face of true danger. 